Welcome back from the coffee break. Council, if we're ready to continue, please proceed. Uh, yes, Mr. Chair, we're ready to proceed. Mr. Kambi will bring in the witness. Thank, Thank you. you. Welcome back, Mr. Witness. Thank you, sir. Um, uh, in the first session, we were just talking about your biographical information, the places that you worked and the positions you've held. And uh, in fact, uh, you you, you, after 2000, you were redeployed to Banjul as commanding officer of the counter espionage division, correct? 2000, I was as commanding officer of the counter officer counter expansion unit. Exactly. Tonyala. And uh, you also became commanding officer for operation. In Arna, the commanding officer is one of the most important people. Exactly. Tonyala. And uh, in 2002, you were appointed director of operations and responsible for presidential affairs. 2002, you were appointed director of operations and member of president of Kuala. Correct. Tonya. And then what happened after that? Mune Arna, the Kuala. Well, I was officer commanding director operations. Um, I run quite a lot of things. Judge of operations. Because there are units under me. Um, except few. As director of operations, um, um, you are responsible of political and uh, dissident groups. You have uh, what we call D4, D3. D4 and D3. All these are units headed by somebody. And uh, at the end of the day, uh, they report to me that anything of importance Proceed. Ten, ten. Yeah. So you, said you dealt with a lot of issues and lots of units reported to you. Yeah, so, except uh, counter espionage, they are directly under the director general. counter espionage. director general Carola. You would agree with me that operations is in fact at the heart of NIA activities. But if you say that, if you say that, what do NIA do with you? The presence is responsible for almost everything. I think that the people who are living in the world And therefore, as director of that department, you would be involved in pretty much everything except external activities or counter-espionage. 
eh itel be kala moti mem mara takku jamalu tamando la bunda kotengulu la menno bije na manke eh bunda ti me yalon ko wol lekata bantala ko luti anim bunda me ba fly counter espionage correct tonya you were at the nerve center of nia activities during this time sayen teng ibe nia la do ko wonin tema do ko wonin na tema fa ngol to say correct with an explanation to nya barbitum kubi je nyen semen sata um nia nia is a secret agent amun ta kullo do ko bundalem and uh, there is this compartment and room sapolu bije would you are you suggesting that you would compartment compartmentation out? i mean do you would you compartment out the director of operations fodu iba fala ko sapo nyim ibe nyim da bondila jele men kata director ti mem marta do kolu sambola yes ah because so, mr, mr. witness mm -hmm. would it make sense for you to direct activities mm -hmm which you are kept in the dark wala min de fo ibe ko lu tamandila le do ko la carola men ya lon ko ite fem folete je amunta e bo nun nete male it could be of course it's possible ha as a keno as a keno when investigators invest investigate in kisi kisi lali e kisi kisi roke and then i am close to the culprit or i'm close to whatever the offender ning aya tara men ita ta tara mem mo ku jaw kela nyinti wala me yetti nyaro ke na tara nten yo mari lo molem wala molem ni men na kolu katata nyola we have this principle ni mu na kolu tarambuloleti ntk ntk need to know and need not to know wala nyinti men nyanta kolu lonna wala mem manyan kolu lonna but this is my this is precisely my point ha wala mon defana e lodu lati director of operations by reason by virtue of your position you need to know director of operations wo palaso dalilo ya itandile ko ite nyanta kala moliti men nyanta kolu lonna but there can be an instant which i will need not to know bari ku falan si soto no le men sa kendi e woto a ni sike nyanto tin tema nyanna lon could you list them if is if you want if you want no because um in the case of in the case of baba i was a victim of baba ko baba la ko baba who baba job baba job ala ko ndefam keta moleti me man toro soto baba job la ko i was victim victimized you i was victimized because if i am left in the service perhaps uh, there will be an information leakage kato ye man toro lanka nyina la ko nin tuta do ko bundala wuto kibaro lu be soto dale men ya lonko e be yole to fintila they lost the story what happened ko nyu la nya fo nyaba mo ne keta you and baba itanim baba oh, baba baba is a brother we are ba from the same place baba mum badi mo leti mbota din kira closeness katata nyola the authorities might think if i'm left in the service Nyatun and kule. as director of operations uh, many things pass through my hand and then perhaps they feel that i should stay away do na law kata nyolo ye nyimuta ko wayri ntelom directeur mem marta do kolu samba nyala nin tuta o pala soto kudo lu bekna kala men ya lon ko mbe kari o kibaro lu jibe munding fintindi lale yo woto na law kata nyolo dalilo le ya kendi ye nyimuta ko woto nte ma nyana tala do ko nyim bundala atela ko kan wala na yem bondi are you suggesting that you were removed because of your relationship with baba job munda ibe nyina fo kan ye bonde do ko nyin kono ilen baba job la hada ma not only not only me but many people are speculating that amang kan te dam anti debara mo jama be nyin mira kan ko well isn't it the case that you were involved in some gold dust and diamond case which government uh used as a basis to terminate your service ara fonyina manka ko la nyaade ko ida bulata sani julay a bi julay a doldo anin e luluo wala ya sabu masakunda ya je ko e jarata ko ke lead council that's a long story lead council wo mutali jam balati you see the thing is uh, i was never going to raise it it's not an issue for us 
Ulo nyinti mampare ya fulanu nkatu wa manke nto la nyati li nyati. But you are suggesting that you were victimized because you had a relationship with Baba Job. Katu yenye nafoko ni aje ya mantoro la atakang ini mbaba Job la badi ya leo sabu. But there is an underlying story leading to your dismissal which is your involvement in diamond and gold dust case. Dari ni mkote duma meya lonko. Asike baba la kote baribitu nyi mfana mkuleti membe lari ndu malako idabu lata uosani kunya leto anilulu otama ndinya. I raise that because I don't want us to pollute the record. We are here looking for the truth. Ngao fo katu malafi tonya nyi nondila kajio nyami. Baribitu ndelbesiri njan tonya nyi ngolekang. So if you agree we put that issue aside, the issue of the reasons for your dismissal. We are not here investigating uh, unlawful dismissals and things like that. So if you agree, we put that aside. As you wish. Lead council, as you wish. Lead council, ni laftala nyamin It's not my victimization. It is your victimization. But I propose that we move on and leave that issue. Thank you very much. So, as director of operations, you need to know it's by far greater than, than you need not to know. You agree with that? Yeah, I know, I know quite a lot of things going on. Because, um, in fact, of the exceptions yeah. you have given to yeah. the need to know, you have listed only one thing, which is conflict of interest. You killing the phone, me along go. Well, I'm a conflict of interest. Well, I'm laughing at that. Like new tampon. You agree with that? Isan tawalal. What do you mean exactly? Ila kumo kuto fa muneti. You have given. You have stated. Yeah, foko. That in the NIA, you have two issues: need to know and need not to know. Kufula wale be NIA wale ni te ijartala ya long ani ngamani jara puri yenyi ndo long. And you say there are instances where you need not know, so so you won't be given the information. Kwa watu do watu 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 do akasi ikatra ifanyi ikanyi alhalo do kona buka jara puri ya ite ya ukubiki baroni long andu buka na ukibaroni ndila. I ask you for examples, and you gave us the baba. Baba job situation. And that signals one issue that is the conflict of interest issue. Conflict of interest. That is, if you have a personal interest in a, in a matter that is before the NIA, you are put aside. Well, I do go on NIA to Ninga, Resulo, or Dinkira Melanco, Ya, so be the quite a Nafaso de Jeleke, Jenki, Kirijanki, the Karala Lokonikon. You agree with that? No, this NTK is a measure to protect any information or any investigation results. Ning NTK Ferolem, Puruka Kibaro Lukanta. Aketa kibaru woki barati meja alonko niye kisikiru woke hanufo ina atasele kibaru menka yeme mfinti ndi. Who fall in the hands of a wrong person or a wrong group. Puro woki baru. Or a wrong organization. Akanadu mwogulo kono meja alonko amanya na lona wala akanadu kafubulu menu manya na lona wala akanadu jamaa mwulu gulo kono menu ya alonko ila kute manya na lona. We agree with that. That is the rationale for such a policy decision. But I'm referring to something completely different. Under what circumstances would, this, would it be said that the director of operations need not know? Something uh, and the only example you have given us is a situation of conflict of interest. 
ye misalo men dinna jam wolam nyinti ko e misalo men al halon men lon ko e la nyale me yalon ko e fitino nafado man dinga ba ko nole no itam ponta ye itam ponta le nyota kile la finna dalu le ta ye nyota kile ye nyota kile okay good so so do you have any other examples fa misal dul fanan soto la banni abota wala yeah because uh, ah kadu I, I, I suffered in uh, many of these kinds of people things. Um, uh, one day, officers went an operation. And this involves a white man. He was arrested. Uh, his wristwatch with a uh, cash of 7,000. Somebody involved is a so name of Drame. Well, then so, uh, the, the, um, one of the friends is a Gambian. They came to the NIA to report that Salmina Drame uh, arrested my friend, uh, uh, took his uh, wristwatch and uh, an amount of 7,000. Salmina drama yen teri muta ayala bulla montoro ta anin dalasi wuli woro wula kodo. Which was unfounded. Me yalong ka mansoto. Because the director summons. Ka tu director kumandiro ke. Almost uh, the director general summons all the directors. Ka tu director general wule ka director lube kumandi. And then we look into the matter. And do nyo kata isa jem besi si nga kwenye mkono jube. It was found that not Salmina. They had to apologize me. So these are the these are kinds of things um, I'm I'm trying to tell you. Uh, 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 because uh, the, what as operatives, just, what you've just as director of operations, as operatives, when you do anything, you report to me. Kato director of operations la bedamen. But sometimes they will do it in isolation. The director of operations may not know. So I have, we are trying to understand under what circumstances would the director of operations not know. You gave us one example, which is situations of conflict of interest. Ba kata kana ka long purga nga faham. Da ukul betara laring alhala jumal to maya long ko abe abe jara la lekuru direct wo ning member operations la kano kodo long. Yemi sal kilindi na wala nyundo ko sulo maya long ko nafal maya long ko nyotam takita. Is is there another instance wherein the director of operations would not know what is going on? For misal dolo fanam betar la jela ba mea longko director of operation walem director me mata do kol tama ndir bulol la abe jare la pour akana ko do lo mel betama ka lead council um, that's a secret agency i'm telling you and information flow at levels kulo do ku bunda mo din kral ti dama ya longko ki baro lu kata nyaming eh amunta enin kulo le kata e ka silo menta you would agree with me that operationally the director of operations is, in fact, is or more likely to be the second most powerful person uh, the organization. Not exactly, because um, the counter espionage unit is a very powerful unit. A seke ama abe mantara lari ngonya katu counter espionage unit wole mkulo sungu ninti nyari la lakano wafana mubunda sembe mabalit. You see, it's, it's, it's counter espionage is, is the totality of measures, you know, taken to protect information. Wo counter espionage wole mbunda ati meya lonko fenfe ninkulo lo ninkuku malom. Ni lado kule mpuruka wakulo kanta akana dumbulu kono meya longo imanya nalon. Personals of the NIA will be even afraid of the unit's members of counter espionage. 
ani do kulal men fonglu be nai e do lu fonglu kasila do kulal do lu lale men yalon ko o lebe do kula counter espionage the fact of the, the fact of the matter is to protect all informations amun to fall in the wrong hand puruka kataka kibaro lu be kanta anyin kamala akana dum bulok jawo ko de i can understand that. no so for harm no uh, but we too have to uh, we have to call a spade a spade eh barto nyaamu men de fonsi o vordon when it comes to the actual day to day operations of the nia the director of operations mm. would have more clout and would have more information than the counter espionage in na do nia la lungolun do ko nyinto director me mata do ko tamandir nyaala a telebe sembo soto la katambi eh director me na wala marta counter espionage unit la I agree with you. In fact, if you look at the organization of the NIA, the, the organization cannot function. Without the director of operations. Ning um, ayata director to je mem mata do ko tamandir nyaala. there are divisions interlinked. But all those divisions report to the director of operations. Not all the divisions. I mean all I mean all the divisions within operations. You've said it here before that all these units and sections will report to you. Yeah. A enyum fonun janko bo bundalu menno yalon ko kata sappan sappan di wol be kana kibaro di tela. In fact when it comes to actual information you you as director of operations have your ear closer to the ground than the director general ni na ra do do ko tamandiri nyaalo te director me alanko te la mata do ko tamandiri nyaala ite le ka ke mo me alanko ha kilo ka taraw banta la do ko wol ke me nga ke je ka tambin director general me kordat yo fam that's that's correct o mo to nyaalde in fact the director general would depend on you kordat yo fam atikala su jobe akala jiko be la e telecom for information as to what is going on pour ki baro la ka lon ko mune be kering true or false to nya fa fani ya well yes because um kadu ah, sometimes when he is going for security council meeting modul na bita kanta council bala be ngoto the office of the vice president vice president la office auto um, sometimes he goes along with me Until later, I was co-opted as a member of the Security Council. And for marrying or not, until from that day, the Qatar will continue to follow. Just for certain clarifications, when we go there. And and the reason for that, the rationale for that, is because you are the repository of information at the NIA at the time. The little me o sabu wole yas wole mnyindi ko. wo wato la itela mot me yalon ko ki barol be ni e be kum ben nyoka be kan etele kan wala ya sabu ena eje ya sometimes uh, they go informations go directly to the analysis division they submit it to the analysis division they bypass ha to modolu ni o ki barol dolu so ton ta to modolu o ki barol ka tambin tele le yeta do ko bunda do la me yalon ko itele ka ki barol tamé ke tenten e aka tambile drong e otumo e ka futandi o bundal mr witness uh, we've all worked in investigation outfits be nga do ko ke kiskisir bundal tole analysis is not a consumer of information they analyze and send it to the consumer of information which is your department operations bunda men ka ke ki baro ni ka tamé wol man ke dinkira de meyalon ko tolle ka marki baro le ka tamé la niya tamé fo ipare da ya ki bunda la meyalon ko wala marta ki baro la analysis e do ko do ko tamandir in operations there won't be any analysis department if there is no operations department bunda da sotala meyalon ko wala ka ki baro ni ka tamé ka 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 kesen ning ayata bunda do ta je meyalon ko wala marta do ko tamandir nyaala analysis is a service provider to Ana, operations unit you agree with me bunda men ga kibaro nyin tamé wo mo bunda de mey yalon ko atel ka kibaro ta ka di do do ko bunda me marra do ko fa ngota man dirnya fa wala do you agree with that sanda wala no no ani proceed um tendam wara lead council lead council that place is a secret department 
Botomo kulo doku bundalet. We all know that. Listen. We all know that. Yes. Mr. Bisons are formed. And, <laughs> and let's watch the language. Listen is not very polite, but proceed, please. Pardon? Go ahead. These divisions are headed by officers. And they have operatives under them. And they go and procure information. As operatives, when they come to the office, whatever, whatever information they may, they may come across, being subversive, being a criminal intelligence, they write and then pass it to the head. But sometimes we'll, we'll pass it straight to the analysis division. Some will, some will bring the raw to me before going to the analysis division. Okay. That bit which is submitted directly to analysis, after the division has analyzed the information, would the report come to you? No, no, no. It goes to the director general. Or the director, director of general intelligence. Yeah. We have the director of intelligence, well, and well, the director of intelligence will discuss the intelligence product with the director general. Modul asitamu ya memu director to memarta di kulo dinkaringula. Wo kulo londi dinkaringudung dinkaringudung jamaa jamaa wunin director general lekasi kakuo kacha. Mr. Witness, you're yeah. talking about intelligence gathering. Do you agree with that? Is it, uh, I don't want to go too far into this because <laughs> intelligence <laughs> service I've been saying this. It's a secret agent. We cannot be here to tell you this is what they do, this is what they don't do. Uh, uh, yeah, we, we, we can do that to the extent that we do not compromise uh, national security issues. So, what do you Bangkok, and perhaps your answer is because you do not understand, maybe because you don't understand my question. My question is for operational activities of the NIA. Whenever any aspect of that is submitted to analysis, the report must necessarily be as director of operations. For operational activities. Operations Do you agree with that? No. 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 It goes and this way. After the analysis, they think the analysis will look into it and see. This information, uh, I mean, is, is not correct or something is missing, what we call retax. Perhaps they will call the, the attention of the auto. Modolu Kamala, Kibaro Safe Kanati is your Kumandi. This and that is missing so that we can have an intelligence report. That's how it goes. We are not here to interrogate the workflow of the NIA. The workflow. We are just trying to find out how much would ordinarily come to the director of operations. You would agree with me that in general, 
Most of the information would come to the director of operations. Ibe son namma leko jama jama kibaro jama beje abe kana jarning director of memara do ko thaman rinyal. Say for operational activities. Puru njinga mal puru do ko njimbe kelo na njame. Would you agree with that? Ibe son na walaba. These are raw informations. We don't. But but do you agree with that? Yes, raw informations they come to me. Ha, nso ndale kibaro lume nye kafunyoma doron doron janning kube bola jevo le kafuta mali. That's right. And in that position, Lord mm Lado, -hmm. it is difficult for the director of operations to not know the activities that were ongoing in the agency. Abe kolea la puru director me alonko atela marta do kwa tamani ni nyala puru akana alono kwa la me ni alonko wale betamaka. I take your silence to be yes. Ila dayo nying bata la kwa wala muhadi. Yes. Ha. During your time at the NIA, I have your statement here. Ila watu wame na ibe nung NIA. Ila kumaka masafiru wame mbulu jane. You said during your time at the NIA. Ko watu wame na ibe nung NIA. You were aware of only two instances where there has been beatings and torture. Do you recall that? Yeah, yeah, I wrote it. What are those instances? What are those instances? I think it's before you there. Let me have a lying. Yes, I am asking you questions. You answer. Don't read from the statement. Be any ninga kana kana ninga karo jabi kana kana karang. Just put the statement aside. Makau isafe ro nyila statement ninga alandi karala ro. Put that aside. Alandi karala. Answer my question. Any ninga karo jabi. You said throughout your time at NIA, starting from July 22nd, 1994, or one week thereafter. Until the time you were terminated, you were aware of only two instances of torture. What in the Gabriti Ada Mutai Kadu Koke and I will in July nineteen ninety four, the four water men a year do go Kundu and I age. What if you run them? Ya Kalamuta, what more and Mutai Raja Maria Buteje and I age. Please tell us those instances. What if you run for your back? Council, I will tell you, but I'm not going to tell you. 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 You don't know? Torture. Can you define it? Yes, I can. But I'm not the one testifying. I'll ask you. I'll ask you to define it. What do you understand it to mean? Torture. Torture is a high grade of punishment. It's a high grade of punishment. Ulem tilimbali ya Santo Mati, tilimbali ya Selerino Santo, kamo kamo batandi, kamo dimindi, slapping, tulugusaro, kicking, kamo damfu. I don't take it to be a torture. Mauluta de kafu ulbe tajire ya kono. I call it as a reprimand. Namuta wamu mo mo kamo kulu ulem kulu rilangote. Torture. Tajire ya. You use machines heavy. Machines to 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 torture somebody painfully. Well, I'm coming out of machine fengo. Kamo balajato dimindi dimindi nya jawola. What planet do you live in? It's the infliction. I'm in the atmosphere. If you inflict pain or suffering on a person. That is torture. If you inflict pain on a person for the purposes of eliciting information, it is torture. Does it change the equation? Well, if you take all that to be torture, well, it's torture. But the fact of the matter is, you worked in an institution which used torture as an instrument to obtain information from people or to punish people. 
Do you agree with that? Ils sont dans la What you think? Yeme mira. Is reasonable chastisement? Eh, mo hakilo fanansi wa muda nola. Reasonable chastisement, no. <laughs> that is the uh, uh, disciplining of somebody. Wala kamo kulu, kamo kulu wala mo kang. Or, or to, to uh, you use a term to you uh, to reprimand. Reprimand. <laughs> well, reprimand is verbal. It's not physical. Reprimand. You, you reprimand somebody using words. You don't reprimand somebody by beating the person. Ekamo doya kumakanga lutole, bari kamo doya ubuka ke liparo liparo. Amunda kumakanga lutole. Also a form of punishment to yeah. to show the person or the person that what we have done is wrong. Nimfanamu doya rolti kafu moyenko yemenke amam betaya. Uh, let me ask you this question. As an NIA officer, yes, do you have the authority to beat anybody? For Lua, Sembo Dila Vampurka Moli Papa. I have not seen it written anywhere. Massa Fering with your Do you think? I'm not saying whether you have seen it written. Do you think that you have the authority to be Yes, I do. Well, no. Now you believe that you don't have the authority to be anywhere. You don't have the authority to slap anybody. Do you agree? Well, according to the law. And how about according to the working methods of the NIA? Sometimes these things are used beyond your own control. You um, mean to tell because me? Because let me you ask use... my question. Let me ask my question. Mm -hmm. What do you mean by beyond your control? You raise your hand. Mm -hmm. You slap a person. And you say it's beyond your control. Is that what you telling us? No. What do you mean by you? Sometimes you do these things, but it's beyond your control. Yeah, because people are different. Somebody will do something, appear before you, and will lie to you. Emotionally, you, 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 you slap just to, just to get the truth out of him. Was that normal? Was that normal? According to the law. Was that normal at the NIA? NIA was not normal. During your time. Yes. During your time. No, it is not. Honey, it is not normal. Was it usual practice during your time? No. Honey. It never used to happen. No, I don't remember. I don't remember because instances. Okay. Mr. Witness, you see? Careful what you say. You gave it to us as an example of what used to happen. Obviously, your mind went to some instances. And when you challenged, you say you don't remember. As if your mind never went to anything. I cannot tell you that in the TRRC, TRRC. the chairman would. Chairman be. And then I turn around and say, I don't in fact know that there is a chairman. The brain does not function like that. Do you have Yeah, because during my time, I 
reorganize the institution. Let's not talk about that yet. No. The reorganization. To eliminate. Uh, no, no. Let's not talk about the reorganization to eliminate the tortures and the beatings. Let's talk about the beatings first and the tortures. We necessitated the reorganization. Diamu butero ni tajire ya la menu kake nunge mena rena sababu fo hakilo na rena sura puru kaje topo to kuka londe kunyado ni ala mianu kwa akende adal. Nobody will deny that there is no torture going on in the NIA. Welcome home. But do you recall, Mr. Witness, that just a minute ago, mm -hmm. you told us that this was not normal at the NIA? It was not happening. You could not remember a single incident. You told us that two minutes ago. Council. Council. When I was a subordinate, I have no powers that over... No, no, no. Mr. Witness, let's just answer the question asked. Do you agree that what you told us two minutes ago is different from what you're telling us now? You told us two minutes ago, this was not normal, it was not happening, you can't remember it happening. Now you're telling us nobody can deny that these things used to happen. You change your story. Do you agree with that? And then we proceed. Something can happen somewhere, but it's not normal there. I am saying Mr. it in Witness, that context. You are talking about occurrence. Was it happening? And you, you, you understand the English language perfectly well. No, no, no. You have a better command than me. But it's not a competition. Uh, it's not a competition. You have, you are proficient in the language, and and that's the most important thing. Mandara nyose ya bendo jande. Yetuba bukango nyingi ya muela asenyati yama. You just told us a minute ago, two minutes ago, that this was not normal there. It was not happening. You can't remember it happening. Now you are telling us that no one can deny this was happening. Both cannot be true. Which is the truth? The first one Follow or the last one? See, I was going to explain counsel. Okay. But you just, just, let's just answer the question and we move on. If we are arguing over little, little things, we'll never, we will never make progress. Let's answer the question. Which is the truth? The first one or the last one? Normal or never happened? Was it happening? It was happening. So when you said before that it wasn't happening, that's not correct. Correct, counsel. How many times mm -hmm. have you seen this happen? I'm not talking about using heavy machines to torture, like tractors and bulldozers, or chainsaws. I am talking about the infliction of pain on a person, either as a punishment or to obtain information, or even for the gratification of the torturer. torturer. Have you been seeing this happen at the NIA? The first time I saw it happened. Half a year ago. Yes. Yeah. Have you been seeing it happen at the NIA? Have you been seeing it happen for the NIA? Have you been seeing it happen at the NIA? Yes. And this was rather frequent. Frequent. 
You know the meaning of the word. You're just buying time to think. To your answer. And, and the thing is, the commissioners are watching. No, when you say fragment, maybe that, that is too much. Maybe it was too much. Frequent. Maybe it was too much. Maybe that is the reason why we say, Mr. Witness, that the NIA was a torture chamber. Are you talking about my time or are you talking about the activities of NIA? During my time. During your time, During torture, time. torture was frequent. Yeah, let's go directly to that point. Answer the question. Uh, was it a frequent phenomenon? Was it something that happened frequently at the NIA? And remember, Mr. Witness, uh, you are on the earth. And we are trying to establish a true historical record of what happened in this country during the 22 years of Germany. Uh, this is you would not be helping this commission if you deviate from the truth. You would not be helping the commission if you allow us to wallow into misinformation. And recall you are adversely mentioned. If you try to seal yourself from responsibility, the commission would note that when they consider amnesty. I just draw this, your attention to this because these are important in you making decisions because I see that you calculating every answer that you give. I don't know if It's quite obvious that your answers are not spontaneous. They're not just coming. It's a very deliberate. You're calculating everything. Mm -hmm. Was torture a frequent tool or instrument used at the NIA to obtain information or to punish people taken to the NIA? For Tajireya Mukuler Meyal Longko, NIA Jedalina Kulan Meyal Longko, Kakamola JK, Tajireya Kakibaro Sote Bulu, or Anto Anunke Kulu Akam. That's a fact, Council, but can I ask you? Mutuality Council, but he seems to ask Arabang. Please proceed. Tenten. The NIA, I'm a product of NSS. NIA, the NSS le la carola. The oath we are talking about. When I was taking over my duties as NSS officer, I was sworn in in the highest room of this land. In cabinet room by Sarah Janha, Secretary General. Cabinet room cabinet Janha. I will not come here to waste the Honorable Commissioner's time. I will not conceal anything. Because I personally during my time, I fought tooth and nail. And I can come up with cases that have been referred back to the to departments as a departmental case. I could have I could have um, prepared their files. Take you to the IGP for prosecution. But I don't. You have failed in your duty. When people commit crimes, 
You do you do carry out an investigation. You should submit the file to the right office to make the decision. You don't make the decision for them by hiding it. That is concealment. These are people working in a department and the department has a code of conduct. Mr. Mr. Witness, you cannot wear concealment of a crime as a badge of honor. That by itself is a crime. And uh, let me just make this as a side comment. That is one of the problems of this country. By doing that, we are fueling corruption. Uh, we, we are engendering uh, uh, non-observance of the law. We are maslahaying the truth by doing things that should matter. So that is not a badge of honor. What you should have done is to report the matter to the police and let the police prosecute. But let's come back to the main subject. Tortures were happening frequently at the NIA during your time. Tajire ya kita kule de meya longko dalin na kule meya longka be kere nung NIA wato ibeje. True or false? Tonya vofania. Tonya. So when you said Biriko that you were aware of only two tortures during your time. That is not exactly correct. You agree with that? I to I. Mr. Witness. You are aware of a whole lot more tortures at the NIA, NIA than the two instances you mentioned. Do you agree with that? No counsel to be aware and to witness is different. Any counsel, kakuomoi, kalong, aning, kasedea, ifadata. Let's take it step by step. Silangata simfani simfala. You are aware of many more than those two instances. Mena bota wati okufulo la menu kwe menu kalamuta. The truth can be very hard, you know. Onya mu kule de mianongo akole ya dada kafindi. Do you agree? Sonda la bang. That you had knowledge of a lot more tortures than the two instances that you mentioned. You agree? Do you agree? Yeah, they happen, but kind of uh, counsel, I, I don't remember, recall. I uh, mentioned them in my statement. <laughs> uh, Mr. Witness, you, you have a fantastic memory. I really marveled at your earlier testimony when you gave us details. You know, you're the first person to tell us that Edward Singate was riding on a 605 from Fajara. Heading towards Banjul, and he fired X number of shots on the way. You are the first person to regurgitate conversations. In fact, you remember in 1994 when the, the, the newly appointed DG would pat your back and tell you certain things in Mandinka. Exact phrase. Bijou motor le kono aye tilim banjul han fo anata atele abina futalal madaming aye kiri danya fula fai santo.
yo adu telefona nyi mfanyenko alawo diji wo tembo ayete le konkon isanyo to akakumolu foye meni alonko aketa je kunyaleti i was taking notes mfana mbe safero la nunde no witness has given us as much detail sede manna jang meye kulu fatam fansi nye ka uwonya as you ko ite ya kenyami memory is not your problem miraro mankete la kole ya kote de ka hakilo bulande you have chosen to forget because it's inconvenient ite nyine tombo pour que fanyi ni ndi la kadra man tembe fe well you you were the same age when you testified 25 minutes ago biriya se de aro ke minute mu ani lulu commando ani saying eh amunda wulu sang kilimo le mude amam fata agreed msonta you try to win no dress the truth amunda left a to nyanyi nyarandi lale What do you mean exactly? I put on your ear and the law. I said it in English, Mr. Witness. Ah, uh, for Angola, come on, Lord. You, you try to window dress the truth. Conceal or what? Both. Munda kakutonya mabu bangwala. No. Nyafulobe. Kani nyandi. I I don't I don't conceal. Well, okay. Ma mabu. Mr. Witness. Sedo. You just told us the yeah, NIA yeah. was a torture institution. NIA mu dingiral mi alan ko tajire ya dew ko dingiralam. True? Tonya? Yes. Ah. You told us you were aware of a whole lot more tortures happening at the NIA. It was frequent. Yeah, mi fonye ko wati jamal del karamu da mi alan ko tajire ya alke daje andun akkenu jel. When you said in your statement you were aware of only two tortures Biriya you were window dressing the truth Biriya fo mole la kuma kan safer ni ko je eh sinya fla ro yola kalamu do mu kula de meya lonko ibe ku ibe ani nyandi kan de dro True or false So nya fo fania Ro I told you but So nya nga wala ko bari kansul Mr witness just answer the question Ni ni karo jabe dro When you talk of only two Biridia mta ku fula ronna you are window dressing the truth Biridia mta ko ek sinya fula ronna kala mta mu kula me anko ba ku ba ni I am ashamed to tell you that you lied I am I am molo ron ka fonya ko ek maso ba That's the truth isn't it You don't tell an elderly person you are lying uh, but, uh, but, 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 but in, in, this, in this business a lie is a lie We don't must know the truth here the lie is a lie Go ngi ngoro ka mo yo fani ala fani am fani a ronne Make so, cancel So if it is not true Okay, I would use false instead of lie. So when you say it was only two, that was false. With courtesy, please. Well, I am being super courteous now by telling you that was false, and be courteous enough to accept the truth. You agree? Yeah. Ah. I wouldn't say you lied. I'll be courteous. Ndaa fala kwe fani yale fu, mbali mbuni yale fala silam. And now, help the commission to understand how the NIA was a torture institution. Silang commission wa makoi ka from Molie. Come NIA ake no ranya di lefo anara na sabadi. Sorry, Chairman. Can counsel before you get to that. After 50 minutes of um waiting to hear what those two tortures were, can you don't don't leave it um without knowing it. Well, otherwise we won't go for lunch until we hear it. Yes, yes. <laughs> we would come to Chiam, them, Mr. Chair. Chiamma. We would come to them. Yaman ko wo tajire ya fulolu menno selo ko bata wolle kalama. Nyantale nga lo mun ni mun nam aye isene andi ni ontenti ta kontong la bari kansul ko mbe futala jele mbe je folale. So help us understand. Ndem ndema ba nga faham. How the NIA Akeno akeno ranya de le NIA was a torture institution. Akeno ranya de fo NIA keda di do ku dingira de menga lon ko tajire ya dingira lam. By the way, Mr. Chair, uh, let me just go back to your statement. Mm -hmm. And page 5, lera lulu nyao. Uh, the witness talked about the two tortures, the two scenarios. Se do e misal fulol me fo yaron ko ay wolel ma bi ay wolel je tajire ya He was, he was he, sorry sorry yeah he was going to refer to that 
you stopped him and then said, let him say it himself. He, he was going to do that. I thought that was a good strategy. Let him. Please um, proceed. Uh, Tell us which two instances yeah. you referred to. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Chair. Uh, it's good to listen sometimes. Um, one of these was um, these money doublers. When the matter was reported to my boss, uh, Daba Marena, Daba Marena, he asked me to come along with him. And these people were operating in Bundung. They do money doubling and counterfeiting. So we went there. And uh, we found them in the house when they were arrested. Bundung, as, um, Bundung police was the jurisdiction close to us. So we took them there, two of them. So we took them there, two of them. So Bundung police there in the. Uh, when you took them, mm -hmm. They were an NIA case. They, this was a NIA case. It was a, it was a NIA case. NIA case. Right? Tonya? Correct? No. NIA case, not as NIA case. This counterfeiting. Look, the dossier was a NIA dossier. Bare as a feta kaito bala nyamenka banke woketa ena ela do kolet. Correct? Yes. So you took them to Bundung police, correct? Yeah. And that is some Bundung police had it. Was the NIA represented at the Bundung police? Of course, we have an office there. An office also to Bundung police. But they were not taken to our office at Bundung station there. They were taken to the charge office. He police station or today. Yes, some took them to the charge office. But the NIA does not charge, does it? But the NIA does not charge, does it? But we brought them for the attention of the police or the CIDs to charge them. to investigate. Okay. And the police ni CID will not be able to do anything. And then what happened? Yeah, on arrival. Um, at the charge office. One of them wanted to deny. So, um, my boss just kicked the um, leg and then he fell on the ground. Who was your uh, boss? Dapa Marena. My boss was killed in the house and he was killed and he was killed and he was killed and he was So, handed over. And then we left for them to investigate the matter. But even that, I don't call it a torture. Uh, Mr. Witness, please tell us the truth. Usman Liberia is here. Yeah, Usman Liberia. Yeah. Usman Liberia. And, and um, Jalo. Something there. Alpha Jalo. Alpha, yeah. Ning Alpha Jalo. The two of them. Yeah. I move follow. Tell us the truth. Tell us the truth. What truth again you want to hear from me? Left to my Fasunjuma Lambulu. What happened to Usman Liberia and Alpha Jalo? I'm going to get Usman Liberia and Alpha Jalo, the police station. Don't be economical with the truth. You want $1,000 of truth, you have given us Tankanyeta. There is nothing to Juruma. You said this guy was just kicked on the foot by Daba. That's what you told us. Yeah. And nothing else. 
That's what you said. Also, you help me. You have help me. I was in there. How you can I tell you? Mr. Witness, you wrote your statement yesterday. <laughs> what, what help no, do you need no, from you? In that, in that paragraph 5 of the statement mm -hmm. you mentioned, did he use the word torture? With double marinade. I am coming. Kicking. I am coming to that. Okay. <laughs> Mr. Chairman, come in and call for allow subpalulu to go on. So, for me, I'm the truth. Say, do you want to hear for long? Your testimony under oath is that double kicked the person on his legs or under his feet. And then you leave the person yes. there, you left. In a certain room, men dwell in the court. Bring a little bit of food at all. The boss, Marin, the boss, I think Marin, I think we are done fasting around that. I think we are boozing that court. I'll not not. I am telling you that speak the truth. You've given us tankanya yeah. of truth when Can, we demand thousand dollars of truth. Council, let's save the time and then tell me this is what you have done. Well, it is not me testifying, Mr. Witness, unfortunately. unfortunately. It is you who was present. This is testifying, tell us the truth and save us time. This is what I can remember during our confrontation at the station. But you, you, me me that that you, have, you, have, you have hardly described a confrontation. Bari you did not even describe a confrontation. Honey, Kenya All you said is we brought the person. And he wanted to deny. Daba kicked his feet. And he was handed over. And we left. left. Yeah, that was due. He was kicked and denied because that was during the preliminary questioning before we left. Okay. Let's, let's put you in the soup first. You, the witness is being, the suspect is being questioned. And he was denying, correct? Correct? Answer? Yes, yes. Uh -huh. And he was kicked because he was denying. Yeah. Correct? Yeah. Just answer so we can hear your answer. Yes. Uh -huh. so that by itself is, is torture. I agree, counsel. So you agree that he already he is tortured? He is tortured. Uh -huh. What other form of torture was meted out on him. Ninga bota wo dam vurolo mun tajire ya si fa do le fanan ketala. Council, I don't remember anything happened. Council, hakilo ma muta kudo ketala. Amnesia again. Pardon? Selective amnesia again. You are being selectful in what you remember and what you don't remember. Mun tay kanya la tombo ne hakilo si bula menna ani hakilo bula menna. Council, this is a long time. Mr. Witness, you wrote your statement a few days ago. So this is not a long time. For you. This, the statement I, I wrote is, is, I think, is almost four to f three to four months ago. I don't know. The statement of means of your appearance here. But, but, but Mr. Witness, that is not helpful to you. It's only yesterday. You I, sat I, here and remembered things, 1988. Is it a Not only that, even 1970. But I'm not going to demand 1970. The headmaster or the principal of Armitage High School, Mr. Blaine in 1970 something and the principal that replaced him from from england mr hebel or something i Hedl, can't even mr hedel mr yeah. hedel you even remember that one i bet you mr kinte cannot remember that yeah. Yeah. 
Alun as a keno Mr. Kinde from Bijan de Hakilo to Bulla. Mr. Witness, memory is not your problem. Remembering details is not your problem. You monkey to la Colea Coti Purke Mira Kai Hakilo Bulan de Colula. You monkey to la Colea today. You are choosing not to remember now because the truth is inconvenient. No. Hakilo Amunta Eka Nyala Tombone Hakilo Bula la Menula. Is in Kaduka Lozinia for the case that Alpha Jalo and Usman Liberia were beaten. At the police station. Oh, you know, man, go to Lanya. They go Alpha Jalo. They said the officer. Umar Liberia. Yes, isn't it the case that they were beaten to confess? Well, I told you. Well, that's not for it. Mr. Witness, you didn't tell us. More for you. You said he was just kicked, and you guys left. Iko ya damfula dong aliya di nim police wala ta. It's only now you are admitting that they were beaten. Sai ne dong ibe song kango ko ke ya ye libale. Yes, counsel. Ah, counsel. Again, when you told us he was just kicked, you were window dressing the truth. Amunda hani kabi silang biri ko mole ko iya damfula drong altara aliya di nyula o ko mukule mi alon ko ibe tonya ni ibani ni ndi kanda drong. True or false? Tonya fafania. I was not window dressing. Mantera ni ndi kan. What you said was false. Maybe I left out something, but it, it was not window dressing. And what you, you left, now what I, you left what out, what you left out, rendered what you gave us to be false. Yeah, men to come at the between where you need to attend the court, men for you. What you must also be told. Accepted, counsel. Insult, counsel. Twice. Now. Sinyafula. <laughs> Don't let it happen too frequently. Because the commissioners would have to determine whether you are truthful or whether you are not. I am very truthful. I am very truthful. When you are caught, you become truthful. And I like that. I like the fact that at the end of the day, the truth comes out. But don't, don't make it too frequent. Uh, just speak the truth. Because if you go around the corners, uh, we would make it very clear that that is not truthful. Let's go to the next example. Tell us the next instance of torture that you you mentioned. That is Serindigal. And the operation was carried out by the police. The paramilitary. Uh, the operation was headed by Tatin Baji. And uh, he wa they, they brought him at... Uh, the NIA. On arrival, all the senior officers, we were on the ground there. Just to see what was happening. But um, I don't remember any, any personnel or personnel of the NIA being part of the... Being part of the... Torture, I mean. Don't remember. Selective amnesia. Again. Who did the torturing? These are paramilitary people. He came on a truck. A full of paramilitary officers. Well, if you cannot recall who did the torturing, at least you should be able to recall how he was tortured. You see, these are officers. You're you not talking about the officers. The Tell us how he was tortured. To be candid enough, he was stripped off. Strip. What do you mean by he was stripped? His clothes were taken out. Yeah, left out of a total urangala. He was stripped naked. Yeah, ura ko abaya ulunyala. And this is a guy who is a religious leader, wasn't he? Nyumbu mo de malongo di na nyato ngo la mfuwande. No, he is not. Anu attend wanted. He's a fake one. Amunta mori tapaleolo. 
who are you to judge whether he is fake or he is real? Did you see, did, did you see his, the Quran he wrote? He said he wrote a Quran. This, this one we have is, 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 is not the right one. And when, he is, when, he, when it is prayer time, um, when they start to call the prayers, when they say, I say, I say, Muhammad that is deleted and will put his name in that Rasulullah. It's a fake Muslim. Uh, Mr. Witness, uh, I am not here to judge whose religion is right or wrong. I have my own belief. And I try to worship what I believe is Islam. But the fact that the way you worship and the way I worship are the same does not give anybody the right to attack somebody else in the way they worship. You believe that the legal had a lot of followers, didn't he? Yeah, he has a lot of followers. Those followers, do they believe him? Very well. Very well. Very well. Very well. Just imagine. They have their own beliefs, whether the belief is right or the belief is wrong. Do you know what the constitution says about religion? No, we are in a secular state. Uh, Anybody can practice your, your religion. But you have the you are depriving them of practicing their own religion. Me, this is totally an operation of the police. Was it the police? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. led the police operation. Ah, mm -hmm. so, so, so are you suggesting to us that the police brought this religious leader at the NIA and tortured him at the NIA? I come to come from where we need to go. Police will hear the local data. Any Mary come on a yard. Not NIA. Let's answer. Come on. It's hard to cut. I just read. You see, the belief that... Just answer the question. The police would apprehend somebody, bring the person to the NIA and torture the person. The police would apprehend somebody, bring the person to the NIA and torture the person. Yes. Ah. Why would they bring the person to the NIA? You know, the German regime, the German regime, the German regime, the German regime, NIA was so popular. NIA told me that I was notorious. And the people. Or notorious. Well, I learned that. It was notorious, not popular. I was told that I was not popular. Notorious, you call it. Ah, I was told that. Yes. For torture. I was told that I was not popular. Yes. Ah. So they brought the person there to be tortured. Yes. Ah. And you want to tell us that this torture was done without the NIA? Yes. Ah. 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 Did NIA consented to the torture? NIA is not going to be able to do it. They consented to that torture. You agree? But they have no option. Uh, fair, don't you believe it? 
Mr. Witness, please, we all know what the balance of power was. The power was not with the police. The power was with the NIA. Sedo mbe alone sembo la nyabe no nyame. Sembo mandra no police wol bulabe NIA len bulu. But their case is their case. Bari ila komu itele la kuti. Membe buloko. Mr. Witness, it is becoming funny now. Sedo the police would arrest somebody. Police wol simo muta. They want to Torture the person. They remove the person from the police. And take the person to the NIA. To torture the person. There. Does it make logical sense? See, the NIA, that's where the head of state believes whoever is taken to that place, the truth will prevail. Or they will get the hell out of him or. or, or, or that's, that's the belief. Let me. Uh, that was the belief. NIA was the talk through center. NIA has a lot of names. Talk through center. <laughs> And, and, and the tool that was used to make people talk through was torture. But, counsel, answer my question. Hmm? Yeah. Uh, uh, what? Repeat your question again. The NIA was used as the center where people would be tortured to stop the truth, according to Jame. Yes. And of the tools to be used to get these people to speak the truth according to Jame, we are state security officers and gadgets like beating and torture, torture, torture items. You agree? Yes. Yes. And in those or among those security agents who are used to torture, Comprise of who? Um, truth? No. truth? Yeah. yeah. No, normally, the, when these uh, high profile cases come to NIA, they sort of uh, select people. Who have the professional way investigation and they know the law too. And we law long. Either from the police. police la Sometimes personnel from the President's office, state guard. Modul dul kabonam president wala office auto menge the state guard the menu kamansa kanta. To join the investigators. Kuru yena kafu kisi kisi rila luma. But um, high-profile cases are not handled NIA alone. Bari in those days. Aketa mo la kuti me ya longo palasi bati olemu wo NIA uludam mambuka ukuwa marade. You have gone around and around. You have not answered my question. Murun murun dala bari hani kabi inde la nyini karo emo jabida. My question is this. We have agreed that Yajame used two instruments to ensure that people who are taken to the NIA would talk the truth according to yes, your answer is yes. Yes. Ha. One, Killing. you said, was security agents. Mm -hmm. 
The other is torture implements like canes, whips. Fulanja mo mendo wala mijora ngole mialongo fole lembang buso lembang. So who are these security agents who were used? Juma lenye tangu abunda deme ni alongo. And so that people will talk through. Iki muna fa wala la kaje ko yeyi mo le muda puru ika ke tajire ya yaje ko puru kaku makanso tebulu. Juma lenye tangu abunda do hulalti. Iki muna fa ni menura. It's the police, NIA, and the army. Well, and police, NIA, and in Soja role. Well, up to 2002, mm -hmm. the army rarely participated in these tortures. That is the truth, isn't it? In fact, uh, during my time as director of operations, high profile case like Serin Digal's case. Who kuma balu menketa nyim moba kunya luti member ko sering digal la kuo brought to the NIA. Ye menu nati NIA. I I don't think I think it's the first case. Ngamira wolem ku followed during my time as director operations. Ndela watu mengake director ya la operations. You still have not answered my question. Ani kabi nani ngaro de imajabi. You still have not answered my question. Ani kabi imajabi de. Who would be the security officers? Jumalle mutangko bunda do kulalti. Who would be used to Men, ensure that this person talks through? Many alangko ike muna fan ni wala la kaje ko nyimari me ya muda kaje ko kakuma kamso rabu. You've given us a list. Yeto lel dinna. You've included the army. Police is soldier role foje. I told you that in 2000 up to 2002. Na imfoe hani ka katabula for 2002 sanga kono. The soldiers were rarely used in such operations. So, Jaro, purke muna fangi la tajire yaro amansi ya baken. Do you agree? Mko iso fai son dawala la bang. Yes. Ha. So let's put the soldiers aside. Uranga so Jaro la kuo ngao jenge ndi karala. Who are the people who were used? The security personnel who were used? Silan, silan. Nini so Jaro bora je? Tangu bunda dogula la karola. Jumal la ike muna fangi njumal la kamulta ke tajire ya. Nini so Jaro bora je? Well, you have the state guard. State they guard are part of the you. state guards are soldiers. State guard soldier all them. Oh, plain clothes, I mean. Men who become uniform or dumb. Because the operation was directed by the head of state. That was the thing by the headed. Men who are directed by the head of state. Men who are the yamarul di wolem banku nyatong koti kota tin ba ye men nyatong kaya. Which operation are you talking about? Seri indigal I'm talking about. Seri indigal la kumole foka. So, in fact, you're telling the commission that the torture of Seri indigal was... Could you continue? I'm going to come here for commission where you're going to say Seri indigal la tajire ya nying, tentemba. Was done, was, 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 was done at the NIA. Directed by who? At NIA le. Keta NIA le, jumale ya kangodi. Directed by who? Jumale ya Marodi. The, 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 the press, head of state, President Jame. Banku Nyatonko, President Jame le ya kangodi. Convenient point to stop, Mr. Chair, for lunch break. Yes, indeed. Um, uh, we'll take uh, one hour lunch break and uh, come back at um, 2.30. Meetings adjourned.